Hey guys, so today I have another thrift store slash antique haul for you. I haven't done one of these in quite a while, and since I've been going to a variety of places recently, I thought now would be a good time to show you what I've got. So the first thing is this sweater. It's this nice tan, gray, purpley kind of color, and it's really comfortable, and it has this little pocket. These are really on trend right now, and so I thought it would be a good piece to have in my closet. It's a neutral, it goes with a lot of things. I'm sorry if you guys can hear some background noise. Uh, my window is open and there's some people in my apartment right now, so sorry about that, but this is the most opportune time to film. So the second item I have is this green emerald sweater. It's a v-neck, very classic, and it's just a really nice material, very thick and durable. And I really like this because it's a pop of color, but it's not anything too wild. So it's really nice, and I don't really own anything in this color either. Next, I have a pair of jeans. And the reason why I picked these up is actually because of the embroidery on the side. So there's these really pretty roses and leaves. Usually when I go thrifting, there's not a lot of embroidered pieces, which is something I really enjoy and a kind of style that I really like right now. So these were a really good find. Uh, they're by the brand Sugar Magnolia. I have never heard of them, but they're super comfortable and a dark wash, which I usually prefer more than light wash. And then next I have this sweater, which is probably my favorite just in terms of it's the most unique. Um, it starts with this pretty seafoam green color, then transitions into a cream, a bright pink, and then a navy. And I really love the sleeves because they have more of a bell silhouette rather than just a straight cut. I think it's a unique detail and it's really soft, so this was a good find as well. Most of these items too came from my Goodwill, and then a couple of the other things I'll show you came from another place. This shirt also came from Goodwill. It has a ruffle detail, and it's kind of that peplum style, which is something I love. And once again, I couldn't resist because it had embroidery, and this is one of my favorite things, and I'm just really glad that I picked it up. So it's a really good, just staple piece. Next is this super pretty olive green sweater. It's really long, which I tend to love when they're open cardigans like this. I just think that it's more of an interesting silhouette and it's just really nice to wear with leggings or things like that. Next up, surprisingly, is the only dress that I bought. And usually when I go thrifting, I tend to look at the dress section first. But this is a really lovely dress. It has a gray background and then a floral print. And I like the sleeves because they're a little longer than just typical short sleeves and it is a T length, which is a style that I am tending to prefer nowadays just because I don't have to worry about my dresses being short. And it's just a really cute summer dress that I've already worn when I went to Arizona. The next location that I checked out was an antique store that is downtown in my college town. And I've never been there before until now, which I have totally been missing out on because it is just this huge warehouse of everything you could imagine. And it's all really cute things and things that are super interesting. And so when I stumbled in there, the first thing that I saw was this jean jacket. And so I have a problem usually finding a good jean jacket. I tend to think that the silhouette just looks kind of boxy on me and it's not very flattering, but this one is perfect. It has sleeves that are more fitted so I don't have to worry about that and a more relaxed shoulder as well as the fact that it's been obviously very well loved and worn. So this is something I'm super excited about because I haven't previously really owned a jean jacket. Something that I have been obsessed with recently is the trend of using scarves to tie up your hair. This is pretty common, I see a lot of people doing it, but I have only a couple that I really love wearing and so I decided to pick some up. This one is this really pretty blue pattern with white and I just really like rolling them up and then tying my hair into like a half ponytail and tying them in the back. I just think it's a nice little cute touch and it's a good way to add a variety in your outfits. I picked up this other scarf as well. This one has different colors like fuchsia and red and purple and orange and kind of this cool geometric pattern. So that is really lovely. Um, you don't really see the pattern as much when you wear it in your hair, but it's nice because you see a variety of colors. This is probably the items that I spent the most time looking at. 
Uh, these are postcards, and I've gotten really into recently collecting postcards, specifically vintage postcards from places that I've been. I just think that they're super cool, and a lot of them are in really beautiful art styles. This is the first one. It is a postcard from Baltimore, and I just really love the colors and the vintage style of it. This one is one from Arizona, which I just came back from recently, and it's near Flagstaff. And it's these gorgeous sunflowers, it's just really pretty, and I like the unique shape of it with the curved edges. The next is a postcard from Rome, which I believe is a piazza near one of the airports there. And it says that it was a photo color um, in Kodak Extra Chrome, and it's in Italian, which is really nice because I miss Italy more than anything. This postcard shows the Vatican and all the people, and this one's also in Italian. And I was so happy to find these because it's really unusual to find postcards from around the world in these kinds of antique shops. I think this one is my favorite though. It comes from Paris and you can see all of the architectural monuments and all the sites to see. And I just think it's really, really cute. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Hit subscribe if you haven't already and ring that bell button because that'll give you notifications as to when I post. Let me know if this is something that you guys want to see more of. If you want to see vintage style or thrift shopping. This is something that I really love to do. Most of my closet is like 90% thrifted clothing. So I hope you guys have a good day and I will see you later.